Welcome back to Tesh Kid FX for another amazing video and in this video I'll be showing you something that is very interesting how to connect your trading view account to your Bybit account and once you connect those accounts you can be able to maybe open positions from your on your Bybit account from your trading view also maybe check your balance close positions that is what I want to guide you on how you do it here on trading view and the very first thing is to search on your browser trading view dot to stroke anywhere once you search for that site this is the site that you should be redirected to and the next thing is also creating your bybit account so for those that don't have a bybit account i have a link in the description box which you can use to create your own account and once you log into your bybit account and you have also verified your account the next thing is to connect your trading view to your bybit account and here on trading view dot to you just tap on this platform icon which is right here and once you tap on that you can see a list of platforms that you can connect to your trading view account such as binance bitmex bybit discord twitter mt5 and so many others but for the purposes of this video i'll be showing you how to connect your trading view to your bybit account and i just need to tap on the connect option which is right here and once you tap on that you see a bit of a guide over here on how to connect your bybit account to your trading view account and in this video that is what i'll be walking you through and the very first thing to do is creating your api credentials and your api credentials are created on your bybit account so i just need to jump to my bybit account and on this profile icon i just tap on that then down there you can see api you tap on api here on the api management this is where you create your api keys by just tapping on the create new key tab which is right there then you can select either api transactions or you you can just select the connect to that party and once you tick on the connect to that party applications you can see trading view appears down there automatically and if you use the api transactions you just need to create a name for that api key let's say by bit test you can give it that name then down there we also need to give the api some uh, some permissions that is the permissions can either be read and write and maybe read only once you choose the read only you'll be limiting your api key to a few things so you can read all through those instructions that are right there the things that that api key can do for me i'll be using read and write and then tap on permission i want to give my api key all these permissions then tap on submit then on doing that you need to undergo through the verification process so that the api key can be created once you have done that then you can see the next page says that the key has been successively added and these are my api keys and also the secret key so i need to copy the api key then go back to my trading view dot to application uh, that is the website then paste that api key right there then tap on next then the next step is keying in your secret key so you go back to your bybit account on the api secret you can see that address that is down there you just tap on copy then go back to your trading view and paste it over there then tap on next then on the next step this is a testnet account and on the instructions it reads that if you are using a testnet account that is a trading free a risk free crypto account you need to check this box that is down here that is if you are using a testnet account then tap on next once you have done that then the next thing is customizing your webhook and this customization is done by giving a unique name to the to the webhook that you are creating down here so we can name it by bit dot testing like that then tap on finish once you tap on finish this is the page that you should be directed to and over here we can send a test to make sure that this connection is working and down there you also have a list of commands that you can use maybe to open positions on your account also cancel orders view your balance and also close positions and i'll do an example of how this is done and if we are doing an example maybe to check our balance on our bybit account there's this command that you need to type in 
the balance the word balance or maybe bal then the next thing is to enter the coin that you want to check the balance of so maybe balance btc that will be giving you a balance the balance for btc and those commands are typed in up here so we can type maybe i can first check whether i have any amounts here on my bybit account so i need to go to assets here on my bybit account you can see i have a small value of btc so i can go back to my uh, trading view account then send a test to check my btc account to see whether that amount will match with the amount that uh, trading view will be giving me over here so that's how you connect your bybit account to your trading view account though i'm having a bit of trouble here checking my balance and that's all for this video